What's up, everybody? So if you're like me, I'm sure you've been seeing ads all over Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter about social casinos. And it's hard to decipher what exactly these social casinos are. So I'm here today to give you some information and kind of break down exactly what social casinos are. So let's get at it. I think it's really important for me to start off by saying that I am not sponsored by any social casino. Um, I play social casinos because I really enjoy it. I live in Texas and there are no casinos anywhere close to me. The closest one is four and a half hours away. So social casinos have allowed me to enjoy my hobby without having to pay for gas, hotels, or flights to get to a casino. So I wanted to let you know right off the bat that I'm not sponsored by any social casino. Now, you're probably wondering, how are social casinos legal? I thought casinos online were not legal. Well, it's true. There are certain exceptions. Certain states do allow online gambling, but social casinos aren't considering gambling sites. They're considered sweepstakes sites. And they are governed, and this is very important, they are governed under U.S. sweepstakes law, and they are regulated by multiple federal agencies to include the Department of Justice and the U.S. Customs Enforcement and Trade Commission. So they are a regulated industry in the United States. Now, now 40 of the states allow social casinos. Three states, it's illegal. That is Washington, Nevada, and Idaho. Now, depending on what state you are, you do need to check what your local laws. But for the vast majority of people in the United States, social casinos are legal. So what are social casinos or sweepstakes casinos? The easiest way I can explain this is think about when you were a kid and you went to a place like Chuck E. G's. Now, to play the games, you had to put a dollar into a token machine. Now, that token machine gave you four tokens and you would go play a game. Now, that game would then give you tickets and you could take those tickets and you could redeem them for prizes at the counter. The principle behind this is a, pretty much the principle behind social casinos. You're not playing with real money. Now, there are some finite things about it, and we'll get into that. So one of the big things is that by law, a social casino cannot require you to pay to be part of the sweepstakes. Now, they do this by when you initially sign up, you get what's called GC coins or gold coins. Um, different sites have different names for them. Now, these coins... You get them for free when you first sign up, and then they offer you daily uh, coins as well. These coins can be played on any of the games on the site, and if you should so be lucky enough, they can grow and grow and grow as you play on the different games. Now, these GC coins have zero monetary value. They are worth nothing outside of that social casino. The other kind of coin that you get on these social casinos are SC coins. They call them different things on different casinos, but we'll call them sweep coins. Most casinos call them sweep coins. Now, like I said, you're not obligated to purchase those gold coins, those GC coins. But if you should so choose to, these social sites will also give you an equal or greater amount in SC coins. For example... Let's say you've played through all of the GC coins that you were given and you want to play some more and you can purchase 1 million GC coins for $29.99. Well, when you make that purchase for $29.99, you will also be given, let's say, $30 worth of SC coins. Now these SC coins can be redeemed for prizes or money. And that's how it works. So you are not obligated 
to get GC coins. If you choose to, you will also receive an equal or greater amount in SC coins. And these SC coins can then be redeemed for money. Now, does that mean you can just purchase these SC coins with your GC coins and then cash them in? No, you have to play through the games, just like at a casino, right? So you purchase some GC coins, you've got $30 worth of SC coins. Now you can go on there and play with SC coins. And let's say you hit a bonus right off the bat and you win 200 SC coins. You can then redeem those SC coins for actual money or prizes. Now you might be wondering, is it safe? And what's the return to player? Well, you might be surprised about this, because I know I was, that the return to player on these social casinos on their games is generally higher than that of a physical casino, a land-based casino. Now, land-based casinos are governed by federal and state law. And on average, you're looking at a return to player anywhere from 85% to 99.99%. Now that upper end is very rare, right? Most of the games that you'll find on social casinos have a 96% or higher return to player. You know, you would be hard pressed to go to a land-based casino and find a slot machine that has a 99, I'm sorry, a 96% return to player. Now again, this is over the life of the game. There are plenty of times I've gone to casinos and I've played extremely volatile games and hit a bonus right off the bat. And there's times that I've gone to casinos and I haven't won anything. So remember that when you're playing on these sites that you can log on and play and not win anything. Or you can log on and hit a massive jackpot. Which brings us to another point. These social casinos also have jackpot games. And these jackpot games, even in an extremely low denomination, I'm talking 10 cents, 20 cents, you can be eligible for hitting a major that's at $20,000 or a grand that's at a million dollars or higher. That is one of the reasons the return to player is even higher on these sites is because at a low, low bet, you have the possibility of winning one of these massive grands, which you really just don't have that option at a land-based casino. Now, is it safe? I've been playing on Stack, Pulse, Wow Vegas, Spree, Chumba, some of the largest social casinos online. And I have put in my own money and I have redeemed from all of these sites. Now, some sites are better than others. For instance, Chumba, sometimes you get your money back in one day. Whereas Wow Vegas, I can expect it in a week. But I have not had any experience that has been negative when it comes to redeeming my coins. That being said, most have some kind of fine print in the redemptions page that does state after a certain denomination, payment may be slower. Right, so let's say you do hit that grand for $20,000. It might take two weeks for them to deposit that money, but you will get it. So that's something to keep in mind. But in my experience and other people that I've talked to on these who have played on social casinos, it's safe. It is really safe. Now, there are scrupulous things out there. I'm sure you've seen these deep fakes online with Mr. Beast and you can tell it's some sketchy social casino, but just like anything, do your research, right? I can tell you that Chumba, Pulse, Spree, Wow Vegas, um, Stack, these are reputable sites that I have used that I have not had any trouble with. And that is my experience and that is the experience of my friends and other people that I know. So they are safe in my opinion. So you're not going to find your traditional land-based casino games here. You're not going to find Blazing Sevens or Cleopatra or any of the Dragonlink games. 
but that doesn't mean you're not going to find a plethora of games. Each social casino site has thousands of games to choose from. From traditional three-line games, three real single-line games, to hold and spin feature games like you would see in Lightning Link or Dragon Link. There are dozens of manufacturers and they all are represented on all of the large social casinos. So, if you log on to WoW Vegas or Spree or McLuck or Pulse or Stack, you're gonna find Pragmatic. You're gonna find Three Oak. You're gonna find Ruby Red. These game manufacturers are just like IGT or Ainsworth or any of the other traditional casino manufacturers of slot games. All of these manufacturers are regulated just in the same way that the social casinos are. So really, there's a game out there for everyone. Now, we've talked about this already, but the return to player is generally higher in these games than what you will find in a traditional land-based casino. What I really like though, is that on a lot of these games, before you even start playing, or in the information screen once you do start playing, it will tell you not only what the return to player is, but how volatile the game is in comparison. That's why I like certain games on here, because I know that they are low in volatility and have an extremely good high rate to player. Sorry, return to player. One of the other things, and we talked about this earlier, is that you can receive massive jackpots in these bonus rounds. I've hit 300 time multipliers playing pragmatic games. It isn't uncommon to be betting 50, uh, 50 cents, 75 cents, or a dollar and win three, four, five hundred dollars in a bonus round. So, the only real downside is you're not in that casino environment. You're just at home playing or you're at work. But also, that may not be a bad thing. There are plenty of people out there that get social anxiety and like to gamble. So this might be a great option because there is every game that you could ever possibly imagine on these sites. And they are fun and they are interactive. Now are there bad ones? Of course there are bad ones. But one of the good things about this and one of the things you don't get at a casino is that you can play with the coins, the GC coins that aren't worth anything and actually test the game out to see if you like it. And if you do like it, then go ahead and start playing with your SC coins. Is it worth it to play on these sites? Well, I think so. Like I said, I live in a state that doesn't have any casinos. I have to drive to Oklahoma, to New Mexico, or to Louisiana to gamble. And that's a four and a half, five hour drive. I have to pay for gas. I have to then pay for a hotel room. Or if I'm flying to Vegas, I have to pay for airfare. I have to pay for food. It is a costly endeavor for me to just get to enjoy my hobby. Social casinos allow me that ability from the comfort of home. So for me, I really think it is. I think it is well worth it. I have hit some amazing bonuses on these social casinos. Check out my page, you will see. I've hit 200, 300, 400 multipliers on some of these games. And in my experience, the return to player is what they say it is. It is that high. Now, again, it's gambling, right? It's gambling. You may not get anything, but that's where self-control comes into play. That is the only real negative thing that I can say, is that because of the ease of access, if you are prone to having gambling problems, social casinos may not be something you want to start because you have access to it 24-7, seven days a week, morning, night, at lunch, from the, you know, just from your phone or on your laptop. 
So if you have that addictive nature to gambling, you might want to avoid uh, the social casino sites. And you know, please seek help because gambling addiction is a real addiction and it has affected many, many people. But for me, I think that everyone should give it a shot. If you haven't tried it, um, again, I'm not sponsored by anyone. This is just my honest opinion. And if you enjoy it, go play it. And you can play it for free. Yes, you're not gonna win money, but you can play it for free. You, it's just like going to the arcade. You can play all of these fun games for free. And if you're still not sure if you're gonna like the games, you can play them for free before you purchase those SC coins. So that's always an option. I do that all the time. I don't always play with SC coins. A lot of times I'll just go into some of my favorite games and play with those GC coins and kind of see how it is. Or I'll test the waters out. If it's got a buy the bonus option, maybe I'll test the waters out with the buy the, bo buy the bonus option on GC coins. Well, I really hope you found this informative. I really hope that you like this. And if you did, please hit that like and subscribe button. If you have any questions or if you'd like more content having to do with these social casinos, please leave a comment below. And as always, I can't wait to see each and every one of you at the casinos. Have a good one.